Welcome to Outside the Box. So we'll battle these two with each other. Then we'll battle these two with each other. Then we'll battle. We'll battle them. Then we'll battle the super splitters and then the other guys. The super splitter. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. And um, we got our Kato versus Pack Series Four Super Splitters. And we're just gonna go ahead and get into them. You're this guy right, is losing right. to Sand Trap right now. I know, but they're showing you that he how sucks. he splits. Right. I think, I honestly think that Short Out can just destroy Sand Trap. They're just showing you how I Short Out splits completely in half, which is so cool. We had kind of talked about that concept a long time ago. It was like, I mean, cool, they just all they just split completely in half. Um, and they did it, and that is that is awesome. Um, you might have heard our video. <laughs> I doubt it. We only have two of the Super Splitter packs. And um, thank our mom for buying these. Thank our mom, yes. Um, You're right. Mom bought them for us. All right, so we've got Short Out and Sand Trap. Sand Trap is what his what is Sand Trap's elemental power? Uh, Earth. Fire. Fire. I'm <laughs> He's got a green controller. But I'm big brain. Wait. I'm just kidding. Also, there's it's Earth. Earth. All right. So, Sand Trap is elemental power is Earth, and then our Super Splitter, which is short out, yes. has electricity and water. Two elemental powers. You're right. Electricity, well, it's called lightning. lightning, and water. And that is what makes him up, and he splits right between water and lightning. That is really cool. Much like what we saw on the Giants packaging, this packaging, we have just a little hint of an image of each one of the characters. We've got Sand Trap on this side. We've got Short Out on this. And when we head on over to our second Super Splitter versus pack, we've got Burn Down as what elemental powers is Burn Down? He fire is and Earth. Fire and Earth. That is a great combination. I like that. And then accompanying him or versing him is Shredhead, another rendition of Shreddy Bear. Uh, pretty cool. I'm kind of curious how he'll battle. He's got a chain weapon, so mm, we'll see how that goes. Like that one, we have some illustrations on either side of the characters, which I'm, I actually like these illustrations a little bit better than what was on uh, Series 3 stuff. Well, and I thought, like, the first thing I noticed when we got these was, you know, you've got the elemental controller for, like in this case, for Shredhead is purple. Right but shadow, but fight. I think it would be cool if they like did the controller, but they split in half. Split so the half is green, and half is fire. That'd be cool. I know that'd be a little challenging, or at least maybe like the the butt, the trigger, and the pad were one of the elemental colors, and the body of the controller was another elemental. Yeah, all they'd have to do is just take like the green controller color. and the red thing in it. Yeah. yeah, really. I mean, you could swap them out. Actually, we could probably do that. It wouldn't be too hard to swap them out. That is pretty cool. I'm excited to see these guys split. So, Wes, let's open it. We did it. Oh, man, this is really, really cool. Whoa. I love this guy. I mean, already the translucent quality of the lightning and then on the other side with the water that is well also translucent but it's top of his head is not look at this that is really really sweet i absolutely am kind of like just taken I back i love his by shield the... how they did a different shield this time it's like a tsunami instead yeah, of just a it's game like shield. a like a tsunami shield you can kind of see the water swirling there on the front of it that's pretty cool his head being one piece, so to make it water, they had to paint the other half of it. Um, but his body, because they're separate parts, they can make his body translucent, both the yellow and the blue. And then his weapon of choice. Looks like a. It looks tiny? like a. Yeah, like a hammer thing like... with spikes on it. It has the to spot. be electrical. Looks like. Uh, Looks like some electrical thing, crystal. Electrical wires. Let's see if it zooms in there. There at the top, his face is really cool. Damn. Even the artwork on his chest. He looks like he's got like an Iron Man 
uh, power core on the front of his chest. He's got an arc reactor on the front of his chest. That's pretty Whee! fun. I'm a go to the moon. Really cool. So we're going to battle with this guy. I, you know, the controller is the controller. It's pretty, pretty plain. All right, and our next epic warrior is Sandtrap. Man, he looks like he just got off of a golf course in Scotland. Maybe St. Andrews, I don't know. But he has got a golf club that looks like he's hit it over a few people a few times. It's got a big bend in it. Um, he's got the Argyle sweater on, some golf shoes and pants, and a, a really cool hat. I like that hat. I like the color, too. He looks like a guy from Ireland. He kind of looks like a leprechaun. <laughs> he looks like a leprechaun. He's got that red beard. I love it. That is really cool. And again, with the Earth Warriors, I love the green. I love the controllers. They're really nice. So I have a feeling that this guy is going to get just absolutely one-shotted by Short Axe. Three, one, Super Splitter, look at that thing. That is epic. He is held or pinned in there. You can see the bottom of his feet are pinned in on the controller. Look at that. That is cool. Right what is that? You went through him. I think that was really cool. I love the Super Splitter action on Short Out. Let's go ahead and open up this one. Guys, look at Burn down here. You know what? This kind of reminds me of Groot from Garden you know, Gardens. Guardians of the Galaxy. Like, like a half Groot, half I don't know, fire thing, but he kind of looks like <laughs> Rap Snap, like his eyes. I his can mouth. see Rap Snap there a little bit. Yeah. Now he's also got this really crazy chain weapon. I mean That's massive. It is a massive log with spikes on it that is huge and then he's got um well i need to spin him the other way but he's got his shield fire shield you can see it blazing up there the artwork again is amazing i love that he has this little like it's like this hole in the side of a tree but there's like something living inside it you can see a face there that is really cool and the flames on the other side i love it all right again controller eh, it's okay but we gotta see this guy split strike. But first, let's check out Shredhead. And here is Shredhead. Now, the thing, there's always a version of Shreddy Bear, and I love seeing the um, just the changes they make to it. Um, you can see the spikes on the shoulders, the eye patch that is a heart, that is pretty cool. And then we've got this giant mace like chain weapon with, I believe it's a bear. Big, big teeth. Let me see if I can zoom in on that. I, don't know if I can zoom in on that. Let's see if I can zoom in. You can see what that is. See the bear? You can see the bear and the teeth on it. Really cool. Really heavy, much like the log. Let's see how these two chain weapons fare with each other. All right. 
Okay, we've got chain weapons. Who will win? Who will be victorious? Alright, ready? Bye, let's try. Wow, <laughs> you heard that thing hit. Did it hit your hand? Okay, wow, that thing is hard. The longest battle ever. Early the next morning. Perfectly, I can see it. I just, you know, I tried them. I tried with all that Freddy bear that you guys saw. The chain weapon guys are just... A strategy. It's a strategy to play with them, and you guys are having a really hard time split striking, and your I fingers are getting tired. That's really what it comes down to. It's a fatigue thing. Their fingers are getting tired. They came to a draw on that last one. So now what we're going to do, we're going to take short out and burn down, which is currently on fire, and short out is currently being electrified. We're going to battle these two super splitters, and... Mm -hmm. We've got a chain weapon with shield versus a club don't, don't mind me, with Mike. shield. that we can all agree he's OP. Burn down is OP. I'm excited to see Buster Bling as a super Buster splitter. Splits? Buster I, splits. I have Buster Bling in my case. Buster Bling. Buster splits as a super splitter to see how he fares with these two. But I think we can both say that um okay I think me personally I'm gonna just say I like short out design better design he's better. Cooler. I think he looks cooler. But he's better. But yeah, burn down. He's kind of. He's better. a little less cool. He's still really cool, but he's a little better. I did remember what was it the first time you guys battled Wes? You got like knocked in the knuckle with this thing. It like swung around and hit you right in the knuckle. I know it hits your knuckles. Let's That's heavy. It. It's got spikes on it, so. Um, but they both have shields, which makes they have a good defensive weapon, but they also have a good offensive weapon. So Wes, out of the two, out of the versus pack that you got. 
Which character do you like the best? Which one do you like how they okay. look? So in the battle, this dude would just come up and knock him out. <laughs> so with him, he would come up, knock him out, and then come back. So it would have to be short out. Short out. I agree with you. I think short out is, is the, best. the better warrior. Obviously, I think that's the intent, but... Um, also, the way he looks. I mean, I love the concept of Sand Trap. I think it's kind of fun. Golfer, angry, Irish, Scottish golfer. But that is really cool. I love the, the mashup of the lightning and the water. Really cool. So, I like it. All right, Will. Out of your versus pack, which character do you like the best? If anybody in the comments says Shredhead, you're absolutely right. <laughs> <That's> Why? <laughs> I didn't even play with him. This is the best warrior we got. He's OP. He looks really cool. I like him. This is the biggest chain weapon I've ever seen. Like, it is literally... No, we have a bigger one. It is the size of his chest. It is the size of his chest. It might be the same size as... As the captain, maybe, because he had the big... Right. No, but Will, we have a bigger one than that. It was the other chain weapon, dude. The captain. This thing was blue. His chain was blue. Well, yeah, that's the captain. It's a big anchor. Barnacles on it. What's his name? Overboard. Overboard. Okay, he, so yes, that I think Overboard's is the biggest like, chain weapon. Yeah, he's the chain well, weapon. We actually have to should probably yeah. should compare that. We should probably. Compare. But I remember Overboard. Like I would constantly be getting hit in the knuckle with that thing. Like this one, good. I'm not getting hit in the knuckle. So. But basically, but not stuck. So yeah, you're definitely not. Getting hit. But basically, his chain weapon would come here. Basically. Knuckle you right where like one of those things are, and then you grab on your hand and then pull it because you're hitting it again. That would happen to me, and I pulled it, and then Will came up and split striked me because I couldn't. Get... <laughs> <laughs> Will, just to, just to kind of bring it all home here, you like burn down the best, out of right? All four of them. Out of all four of them. I do have to agree. I mean, I, we definitely need to do some more battling to just confirm that we he is. We need to do beastie battling. Well, you know what you could do? You could do these battling. Oh. <laughs> that, was, that was comical. You can tell when one person is just really, really working hard trying to like think about the Here, right to... move and then one person comes in. Here, <laughs> Thanks, guys, for joining us as we unbox two of the Super Splitters for a Kato series. Four. We've got one more to get as far as the versus pack, but we're also going to get some more because there's only how many warriors are in this series? I don't know. Like 16 maybe? 16, 14, 18? I don't know. 20, Something like 000? that. But anyway, we're going to get more. We're going to open them and we're just going to have fun. I absolutely love the characters. I love the idea of them splitting completely in half. I would caution you on taking care of them though because I feel like they could probably break pretty easily compared to just splitting at the waist. He's got a map. Oh, a map. there's a there's a trip there's the triple tag arena. The triple tag team but strike strike arena we, tag thing. We could have gotten this and shown it on this video, but Will <laughs> did not want to get it. I didn't say that. <laughs> Again, fun. Awesome thing. I love it. Hey, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment. Let us know what your favorite character is. Let us know what you think of these warriors. If you've had a chance to battle with them, which one you think is OP. If it is burned down that's OP, we are in agreement with you. Also, make sure you check out our merch store. We're going to keep adding more stuff. It's in the description down below. And as always, we'll catch you on the next one.